left feeling so sexy, so glowy, so dewy. I know, I hope you're feeling me in this tutorial, see? I look like Christmas, but it's kind of cool. Got my bangles on, I hope you don't drool as I take these pictures looking all fresh. I'm capturing your bounty like Elliot Ness, but I took that from Lauren because she's the bomb. Fem C's got it going on, going on. Uh, anyway, bye. So I'm gonna show you how to get this into this. This is very stylish. In a vegan kind of world, I'm so proud of my curls. Very stylish. I hope you can vibe with What up, y'all? So we're going to get started with this video. I'm going to take my Carity, um Smoky Smoke Palette. And what I'm going to do first is I want to kind of have like this bronzy look. So I'm going to go with Poof. Oh, no, there's something in my eye. I'm going to go with Poof. And I'm going to put that in my um, crease. I love Poof because it's a nice orangey brown. It's a transition color. You've seen this before in a lot of my looks. So I'm going to use my Juvia's Place. It is all over the place, but I'm going to use my Kenya Brown. I'm just going to put it in my corners here. This Kenyan Brown, just so we can add some depth. Okay, and I'm going to probably do like a little halo. So, put it all over the eye first. From there, I'm gonna take my Cake Face Concealer. I'm gonna put it on just this middle area. So I can have the halo that I want. Nice pop now I'm going to take my Super Shock Shadow from um, ColourPop in Lightning Bug. It's like a bronzy color. I'm just going to put that right on that area. I love it. And so we're just going to put it right on the area. I'm going to go back in with my Kenya, and I'm just going to give it some more smoke. I'm going to take a little bit of that Sheba, and I'm just going to put it right here as a transition. I'm gonna take this e.l.f. black um, liner and I'm just gonna go and make it like a wing. So I'm gonna go in with my Thrive's Cosmetics uh, Brin uh, Liquid Lash Extensions and I'm just gonna go for the extensions tonight and not for the lashes. I love these, by the way. Yeah, those are like lashes. I'm done right? to this eye, I'm gonna do to this eye, so. All right, so the eyes are done, and what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to glow. I'm gonna try to get this uh, Born to Glow Liquid Eliminator. I'm just gonna rub it all over my face. It's gonna be a nice little addition to my look. I love to glow, but I wanna be like super bronzy, so I'm just gonna take my fingers. See the difference? On, off. So, do it again. Mm -hmm. All right, so I just added some more in my uh, light points so that then I can have a nice, like, you know what I'm saying? So, buying? I don't love the coloring of the ColourPop. Um, Concealer, maybe I got the wrong concealer, but I'm just gonna use my Cake Face Concealer. And as you know, I put my concealer on my hand first, only because it dries so quickly. So just put it on. I think we're nice and blended. So I'm gonna take my ColourPop Deep Dark in 190. And I'm also gonna be doing a review on this uh, foundation. So stay tuned for that. I already did a uh, first impressions. So now I'm gonna make sure I do a full review of the product. No powder for me. I'm just going to wear it like this. 
And I'm gonna take my NYX Color Corrector palette and I'm just gonna go in with my bronzer or my contour and just go in like so. I don't know if I'm gonna be wearing my hair slicked down if I'm gonna wear it in a um, head wrap for the look I'm going for tonight. So. I'm gonna use my Crystal Hydro Mist to give me more of a glow and I'm just gonna also kind of thin out this foundation. Okay, so I'm just gonna go back in and just make sure there's no harsh lines, that I have all of the skin that I want, and that there's no blotchy area, because I feel like there might be some on this side. Okay, that's better. Getting there. I'm gonna use my Juvia's Place uh, Saharan blush, and I love this color, Sola. I'm just gonna make it on my face. It kinda can run like a highlighter too. I'm gonna put a little bit of a towel right there so we can have more of a, a layered effect. So I'm gonna take my Neta Gloss from Ultra Glossy Lip from Ellery, and I'm just gonna place it in my centers. Right, and then I'm gonna take my e.l.f. Imperial Topaz, it's a gloss, and put it on top. You know me, y'all, I love me a glow. Just a nice bronzy, goddess kind of glow. Put a little bit of that bronze on my cheek so I can have a glow. On my cheek so I can have a glow. And I'm gonna finish up my eyes a I'm just bit. gonna do some um, blue underneath. Now I'm going to get dressed. I don't know if I like this coloring in the back, but we'll see how it goes. When see, I'm this edited. side is better, right? You can see everything. Anyway, I'm going to, I don't know if I'm gonna, I don't like this slick down. So I'm probably just gonna wrap my hair up because it didn't turn out the way I wanted it to. I like this side, but this side don't look good to me. So I'm going to uh, get dressed. So right now it is almost eight. Um, I put on my makeup about an hour ago, hour, whatever. So we're gonna see how long it lasts um, throughout the night. So here we go. I'm going for like nerdy chic. I think I'm nerdy chic and sexy. Hey y'all. All right y'all. This is 11 o'clock. So this is five hours later. We're still holding up. Y'all seen Charles before. Anyway, <laughs> I think it's still good. Her usual, the face is always beat. It's always But you know, this is always, always, always you. Beat. This she is always, always a, video. She always like to act like it ain't gonna last. Like she don't, don't know how to paint a face. Come on. I don't wear primer or powder, so. So she doesn't know how to be naturally beautiful. Okay, no, thanks. Bro. I have on makeup, a full face. She know how to like even shit out and make sure that all her beauty shots properly. No, Bye, no, no harsh lines. Bye, no bro. harsh lines. I'm so tired that um, I'm not gonna use my circle light. It's like one o'clock. I put my foundation on at six. So this is seven hours of wear. I feel like you can see some breakage of my um, concealer here. You can see that. Even though it still looks good, um, you see some breakage a little bit here, here. And I'm gonna put my um, picture here in the beginning so you can see, but um, yeah, I mean, this is pretty good for like seven or eight hours. Um, and if you, maybe I will get my circle light because I'm looking at myself right now and it still looks pretty the bomb. So let me go and get it so you can see. See? I mean, it still looks pretty good. So the circle light changes a lot, right? So you can tell. I mean, it's still pretty full coverage, but you know, the breakage is here. Breakage is there, here, here. You know, you see some 
But this is after it's 1.30. Put this on around six, seven and a half hours of wear. So, and the eyeshadow held up too. So, anyway. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and let me know what you think in the comments.